Hello, everybody. How y'all doing today? It's Rusty Champagne here with you, and we are here today with a first look at a demo that is coming out on September 30th. This one is called Arctic Motel Simulator. The description of it on Steam, very simple. It says, have you ever been to the Arctic? Do you want to open a motel in the Arctic? With the company of Aurora, Blizzards, Polar Days, and Nights, Primeval Forests, and Wild Animals, can you turn a rundown motel into a landmark in the Arctic? All I know is this sounds cold. That's the main thing I know. Uh, I do want to reach out to the team, or I do want to send a shout out to the team at uh, One Slice of Pizza Games for reaching out to me and uh, offering me a key to this game to show off to you guys early. So I do thank them very much for that. It is very much appreciated. With that being said, let's hop in and let's see what Arctic Motel Simulator is all about. Now, you've seen this channel enough. You know that we've done quite a number of motel simulators. Um, we have not to date done one that has put us in the frozen tundra. So it'll be interesting to see what life is like uh, once we are here. Now, one thing I might need to do is I might need to turn down the sound a little bit. Dear stranger, you don't know me and I don't know you. I randomly chose an address and sent this letter. So when you're reading this letter, congratulations, this motel is already yours. I've lived in the Arctic all my life from a baby child to an old man now. I've always been accustomed to the cold wind, heavy snow, and beautiful aurora here. But today I saw a beautiful tropical island introduced in the newspaper. I suddenly asked myself the question, I've been in this cold Arctic all my life. Why not change my life while I still have a little energy? Why not go some places I've never been to? I already have enough money for my tropical trips, so I hope to give a random stranger a different life from today, too. So, stranger, congratulations from today on. Welcome to the Arctic. I hope you can run this motel well, so that I will be happy for you when I lie on the beach. Good luck. Okay. Um, the rusty frozen tundra. Oh, uh, uh, let's see. The rusty frozen tundra. We'll do that. That'll work. Now, I am going to turn down the sound just a smidge here because it is a little bit loud, at least in my headset. So we're going to see if I can fix that up. There's our motel sign. Don't it look grand? Uh, we're going to go to settings, and we're going to go to audio, and we're going to slide that down just about like that. There we go. That should be better. And resume. So now the, the initial question I have is, why would we have left where we are to then make our way to the frozen tundra to open a motel in the Arctic? That I don't quite understand that part of the story, but I guess we really wanted to be here. And now that we're here, as always, there is garbage to be picked up because everyone is always dirty everywhere you go. And we got a radio, radio menu. It looks like we got a garbage bag, a mop, a paintbrush, a furniture placement, a shopping cart, a basket, an axe a trowel, a journal, a leaf blower, and a gun. That should be great. Uh, I think I already know what the gun is for. Oh, say, uh, go tab to switch to your that garbage bag and collect it. So the nice thing is that we can just hover and collect just like this. I wonder how much room our garbage bag has. Uh, we shall find out. People really love pizza and milk in this place. That's the one thing I've got. I've gathered out of this. So that's the one thing I'm noticing. I'm going to make another change here. I'm going to see if I can. Settings, we're going to go to, uh, let's see, mouse sensitivity. I need to turn that up a bit. And we're going to go to quality, and we're going to try and turn this down to, uh, we're going to go to, uh, we're going to go to high. Because it feels like uh, I'm having a little bit of a frame rate thing here. So resume, that's better. Yeah, that works better. And the mouse sensitivity is working better, so I'm, I'm liking that. Yeah, man, we're th these guys eat a lot of pizza. A whole lot of pizza. No doubt about it. Is that all the garbage? That is it. Okay, the room is still not ready for rental. So now we need to clean all the stains of room one with your mop. So we're going to go here, grab our mop, and we're just going to whoosh right over it. You can hold down. No, no, you do have to click the mouse every time. So we'll click the mouse each time. It is dark in this room. I'm assuming at some point we're going to be able to do what we always do. Um, but we'll see if we get there. So it seems like the best thing to do is like hold down. And because you've got to like single click it, you cannot hold the mouse button down to keep on uh, getting the getting the stains. So you got to kind of approach them and then just tap them. <laughs> That's what it seems to be. Tap the stain. 
Oh, you might be able to run while you're doing it. Maybe you'll get lucky and get two at the same time. Perhaps. There we go. We got 50 reputation for using a mop. That is good. Try changing the wallpaper of a room. Try painting on the wall. Okay, so press enter for more details. Please switch to paint tool mode, then enter a room to change the wallpaper and paint on walls. Okay, so back here we go to our paint tool. You can paint on the motel walls and also change the wallpaper in the motel rooms. Please check the bottom left tips and edit the brush settings as you like. Some creative paintings will make your motel stand out among others. Okay, so when paint mode enter a room to change the wallpaper, you can also paint on the walls now. Press Q and E for next wallpaper. Press M for edit paintbrush options. Press Z and X to undo redo paintings. So M gives us our brush color. So we are going to set it for our our color. I mean, you know us. That feels pretty close. And I guess we can make the brush size pretty huge. And we got all these interesting things that we can put in here. All right. So I guess you can put those inside the room. Uh, got some famous memes it looks like uh some oh my gosh that is a big brush so if i hit that oh yeah that that literally does what you think it does it just makes a giant circle like that so and apparently we never run out of paint i i like that already oh wow um it changed all of a sudden it got a lot brighter in here i didn't do anything to make that happen it just kind of did so uh i don't know why but for some reason it did now, okay, I so I click there, and I can click there, but these that wall, for whatever reason, I cannot paint. If I click on it, nothing happens. So maybe I can go here and go Q and E for wallpaper. Oh, uh, the quest is finished. Okay, so maybe there's nothing to that one. All right, maybe that wall just kind of stays as it is. Purchase furniture online on the Motel computer to furnish room one. Okay, we can do that. So let us, all right, so daily, oh, so this is the daily summary. Day 21, we earned 150 reputation uh, by doing nothing. <laughs> That's good. Purchase furniture, man, words are hard. Purchase furniture online using the motel computer to furnish room one. So we're going to go here, run across, and make our way to the computer, which should be over here. Uh, I got to take my paintbrush tool off, otherwise I'm going to paint my, uh, I'm going to paint this, and I don't want to do that. So let's go there, and let's go to the motel computer. Let's see. Business management. Oh, so there's all these options that are locked. So motel, store, restaurant, laundromat, gear rental, room service, special agent service. Huh. What do you need a special agent for? I don't know. So let's go. Rooms, that's locked. So these are types of rooms. And there's all kinds of things you can upgrade. So there's going to be a bus stop, a parking lot, a laundry room, an employee cabin, an RV park. Okay. Uh, there's the online shop with disposable soap and chew, chew toys and all condoms. Great. Um, warehouses. We got services for garbage collection. We got employees. We got room service, which is also locked. So, yeah, purchase furniture online using the motel computer. This is the motel computer. So we're going up and down, not seeing anything there. So rooms, that's locked. Upgrade. So that's just upgrading the room types. And, okay, so those are just things that are going to be unlocked in the full game. So, oh, furniture. Here we go. Hover over the, hover the tab to check furniture requirement. So we need a single-seat sofa, a lamp, a nightstand. So we'll get uh, one of these we'll do that and i think it said that we needed a lamp and a nightstand and a single bed so let's find a lamp oh and they are they're all here that's nice so lamp let's do uh, that and nightstand i thought i saw a nightstand somewhere yep there they are and that one looks kind of slick we'll get that we also need a single bed a sink and a toilet Man, those are some sad-looking beds. Uh, we'll get that bed and a sink. The sink looks better than the bed <laughs> and the toilet. So let's get that fancy-looking toilet right there. There's all that. I think that's all we need. So then we're going to go to the cart and purchase all that. $573. We have $3,150, so that is within our budget. 
And now we have finished that quest, so please use your basket when you want to carry more than one item. Switch to ba Oh, that's what the basket is for. Okay. Switch to basket mode. Press right mouse button on each item you want to carry to put it in the basket. Okay, cool. That's nice. So we'll click out of here. We'll click out of here. Can I escape out of here? No. I think I got to click that. So let's run back out. Yeah, the thing I am noticing already is that, the, I mean, for whatever reason, the, the frame rate is a bit stuttery. And I don't know why that is, because, I mean, this, this computer should be able to handle this without any issue. But for whatever reason, the frame rate is a bit skippy. So I don't know if that's a, a me thing or a game thing or whatever. Uh, maybe I need to turn this down even more. So let's go here, settings. And let's go to quality. And let's go to medium. Let's just drop it down again. Maybe that's where I need to go. So, resume, once again. Uh, now it's starting to get a little more grainy, but that's okay. We're going to go to our basket, and we're going to click on these. So, right mouse button to put in basket. Oh, but you do have to, like, uh, press these keys to select, deselect the item in each slot. So, then I guess we have to go to, let's see. Oh, you just got to get over it when it gets green. Got it, got it, got it. All right, so we got all those guys in there. So please wait for the delivery of truck and when goods and packages arrive, stock all of them in the warehouse. All right, so we've got that thing in there. So left mouse button to check the shelf. So we can take all these things and I guess just move them. Oh, maybe uh, we click on it and then move. Can I move them all? I can do that and then move. And they magically turn into all the things that they are. That's kind of nice though. I, I, I kind of like that, not gonna lie. So, all right, we've done that. Please switch to furniture placement remote and furnish room one. All right, so back to room one we go. Let's head that direction. Controls are your usual, WASD, and then uh, left mouse button to sprint. And uh, and then there's, I'm sure there's others, but uh, all, all your basics are the same. Do we have a switch in here? Can I do this? Lights! Um, lights! Lights! Uh, they are not working. Uh, lights! Uh, hello? Lights? Is there a key binding for lights? Let's go here. Settings, key bindings. It's very dark in here. And I want to know, can I turn on the lights? Um, left mouse button should be the interact. So, oh, nope. I don't want to change that. Uh, or do I want to continue? Cancel. And get out of that. There we go. Resume. Uh, right click doesn't work. Left click doesn't work. Maybe I got to do this first. So, put right mouse button to put item into your basket. Oh, we got to go to furniture mode. So, furniture placement. And then we're going to do select Q&E for single seat sofa. And I guess it selects what we got. So, we got to be kind of, whoa, I got to stay in the room when you do this. So, let's try that again. Uh, where did my single seat sofa go? So, uh, oh, there we go. We're going to set that. Uh, man, there's not a lot of space here. So we'll set that like there. Sure. I don't have enough items in the warehouse. Well, where did the one go that I got? Oh, you got to select to the next one. Oh, so you got to pick the one that you actually bought. Oh, that's interesting. All right. So then we're going to uh, then. All right. We're in place mode. So we've done that. So then we can uh, tab. Oh, no. We want to stay in that mode. And then we're going to go to lamp next. So let's see. Where are the lamps? There's the lamp. Okay, so confirm left mouse button. And we've got that kind of lamp. All right, so we'll set that there. Now, how do we get back out? Back, right mouse button. And then nightstands. Okay, we've got that kind of nightstand. So we're going to set that. I, I should have set up the bed first. Set that right in the corner. And then right mouse button to go back. Single bed. We'll set that uh, here. Just like that. Uh, or do I want it against the wall? Maybe I'll put it against the wall. And then the nightstand will be behind the bed. Oh, I don't have that one. Oh, I, I, I got to get used to that. So we've got that one. Okay. And then a sink and a toilet. So right mouse button to go back. We've got a sink. A really nice looking sink. And that goes, is there a bathroom in here? Uh, there's an ironing board. Uh, I guess we can set the sink out here. 
it's one of those motels where you got the sink outside. I don't have that sink. Arr! Okay, that's the sink I've got. And then the toilet. So right mouse button to go back. And toilet. And select the one you have, Rusty. You you can do this. You absolutely can do this. Uh, toilet in the corner. Down on the street. All right. Bully and the Pope boys are playing. Put Nichols happy feet. All right, there's that. I probably butchered those lyrics, but you know what I meant. Um, you unlock prepare room supplies. Prepare room supplies for room one. All right, press enter for more details. Oh, uh, we man, the dates go fast in this game. They really do. They really do. Please go to the room supply cabinet in room one and place required room supplies inside. Each room type requires a certain combination of room supplies. Okay, uh, go away from the toilet. So we're going to left mouse button. To, oh, um, uh, so back to the empty hand. Okay. Guests will use the room supplies placed here during their stay. Some of the items are disposable, such as the soaps. Please do not put in an excessive amount of room supply items, as they will be wasted. If Josh from Let's Game It Out gets his hands on this, you know for sure that one of the first things that Josh is going to do is put everything that he can in these things, just to see what's going to happen. You know this. Don't deny it. We need one of those soap. Move. There. Man, that was easy. Cool. I wish everything could be that easy in life. Prices affect many things. For example, if the price of a room service is too high, I guess we'll not want room service. Set prices wisely based on today's market prices. Market prices are updated daily. Oh, man, that's going to be a pain in the butt. Be sure to check if today's a holiday slash weekend. Is this going to affect motel traffic and make customers more tolerant of high prices? Oh, man, how are you supposed to know what the holidays are in this game? Your motel review score, your motel level, and the seasons can also affect customer tolerance for high prices. Some types of rooms are very popular during certain holidays, so guests are willing to pay more for those types of rooms. That's going to be a lot. I, I'm telling you. It's going to be a lot to keep your eye on. So, there. Go to the price board to set a price for your hourly rooms. So, we're going to go here. Uh, I'm not in the right spot. Uh, it's... Uh, okay, the arrow's there. How do I get there? Do I go around the corner? Oh, I go around the corner. Ha-ha, I got it. So, does it tell you what the market price is? Market price is $9 an hour. Eh, I'll leave it at $10. i am I'm feeling feisty. We'll leave it like that. So, uh, $10 an hour, set price. $10. Ha, I'm, I'm, I'm just going to do it. $10. You can't stop me. You're not the boss of me. I'll, I'll make it 10 and I'll like it. Okay. Time to open for business. Sure. Let's do that. So, we're going to go outside... We're going to follow the arrow. Where is the arrow taking us? All the way out here. We gotta run all the way out here to open the place? <laughs> okay, sure. Uh, click the shiny red button. The motel is open for your convenience. Your motel is now open. Now you can clean, prepare, and decorate the other rooms while you wait for customers. Okay, sure. We'll do that. So, please wait for the guests to arrive and help the guests check in. Wow, he just kind of appeared out of nowhere. He's in a really, really nice car. That almost looked like a Bugatti. Why on earth would you have a Bugatti in the Arctic? Uh, what do I know? Maybe... What, what kind of car is that? It, that it, I, I mean, I don't know much about fancy cars. But I've played enough Forza to know that that felt like it looked like a Bugatti. I, I could be wrong. This is where I need my car guy to know. Let me... And we got a footy player who, for whatever reason, is in the Arctic in his fancy car and wants a $10 motel room. One of these things is not like the other. So, <laughs> okay. It's autumn. We have no electricity in here. Come on, tell me. Lights! How do we turn them on? What's going on here? How do we make that happen? Does that not happen? Does it happen automatically? Hi. How you doing? I don't have a room key in my hand. Uh, here, let me get, let me grab a room key, and let me give it to you. There, you've checked in successfully. Enjoy your time away from all the football. All right, motel guests will write reviews online about their experiences at your motel. Having high ratings will benefit your motel in a number of ways, such as increasing traffic to your motel, getting more people in here with their fancy cars, making guests less likely to complain about high rates. Okay, so, oh, here we go. It's the quest for four stars again. I see how it goes. Oh, man, here come all the people. 
So, uh, what? There were like three cars that went by. Guys, I have one room. Uh, or is that just like the main road? That looks like it's the main road and everyone just drives a really fancy car. Uh, this is so weird. So strange. And the graphics in this look like they're just like absolutely just like super hyper detailed to almost to the detriment of things. But maybe not. Uh, hi. I've seen you before. I don't know where, but I've seen you before. I, uh, how you doing, Chiron Young? You want a room for 17 hours. Unfortunately, I don't have a room. So I, I've got to refuse you for now. It has nothing to do with you. I like your look. I like your beats. Um, you politely let the customer leave. The guest thought the room price was too high and left. I told them I didn't have a room. So, <laughs> it, I mean, he didn't have a choice. It was just, I mean, you, it's like, sorry, I don't have a room. Well, your room prices are too high. I'm out of here. That, that doesn't quite work that way, sir. I hate to tell you this, but, okay, let's go over here. I guess we can start working on room two. So let's do this. Uh, all right, so we're going to go and start getting this cleaned up. The floor is dirty. I know. In the unpredictable weather of the Arctic, guests coming and going sometimes make the floors in the common areas dirty. And that's when you need the mop to take care of it. Area cleanliness is displayed on the screen. And in the area it's too dirty, the te cleanliness text on the screen turns red. Guests sometimes complain about the dirty floors and the motel's reputation will suffer. Please keep all common areas clean or hire an employee to help with the cleaning. Well, you haven't told the spot how to do that yet. So we'll, we'll do that eventually. But for right now, I want to try and get another room going. So that way I can have two different people in here at the same time as opposed to one. Man, there's a lot of dirt spots on this floor. And everybody eats pizza. Is that the only thing there is in the Arctic? Well, there's a lot of bean cans. I'm assuming those are beans. I, I don't know. Uh, we're going to grab our mop and dab at the floor. Oh, so if you dab and swipe, you can get a bunch at once. But you can only click once. So then you got to click and kind of run. And you might get more than one at a time. Or you maybe you can dab and pull. That might be a way to go. Dab and pull. Nope. No, you got to actually. Okay, a guest is checking out. A guest is now checking out. Please retrieve the room key from the guest and return it to its original location. Don't forget to clean the room and prepare the room supplies. You can also hire an employee to do this in the future. Well, I want one now. I'm Veruca Salt. I want an employee, and I want it now. Give it to me now. I want my own squirrel. Um, that was the other one. <laughs> I want my own goose. Okay, uh, where is my office? So let's take the mop out of my hand. They never appreciate when you come at them with a mop, so let's do this. I've got all these people. I've got one room, guys, and I have lights that I can't... Oh, that was crazy. I didn't do anything, and they just came on. That was so weird. Uh, I, you want a room? I don't have one. You want a room? I don't have one. You want a room? I don't have one. Uh, you've, you've had your room. Thank you. I'll take that back. Um, you want a room? I still... It's not ready. Maybe you can hang on a bit and I can get it clean? Perhaps that's the way we can go with this? So, uh, all right. We Our daily income was $280. Uh, okay, cool. We had one positive review. We heard there's a new motel here, so we came to try it out. And we were not disappointed. Whew, man, stroke of luck on our part. <laughs> Meanwhile, eight other people tried to show up here and they couldn't get a room because we only had one dear goodness what did you do in here oh my gosh okay fine we'll clean up you apparently had some beans and milk did you have any pizza no no pizza was in, was consumed in this room uh but you did i don't know what these footprints are uh if they even are footprints was a bear in here what 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 happened okay we got one stain left all we gotta do is the room supplies and, and, the, and the lights just kind of go on and off at random. It's a bit strange. But it's the Arctic, so who knows. So one disposable soap. I can see already I'm going to need more disposable soap. So before I get to that point, we're going to go back to the shop. We're going to go back to the computer. We're going to go back to the office. We're going to go back to the computer in the office. You know what I mean. We're going to go here. We're going to go to, uh, let's see, online shop. And we're going to buy like 10 of these right away because I'm going to need them. So we're just going to buy 10 of those. How much is it going to cost me for that? 30 bucks. That's the best $30 I ever spent. 
So that way I don't run out of those when I least expect it. Okay, I think your room is ready. It is. There you go. You're welcome. Let us now see if we can continue working on room two and make room two ready and see if we can have two of these going at the same time. I believe in our ability to have two rooms ready so we can make double the money. Okay, this room is uh, no stains, no garbage. Let's get some blue paint on this because you know us. We love our orange. We love our blue. Hail alma mater. Ever so true. So true. Let's go and uh, paintbrush options. Let's find a nice deep blue. There you go. That's pretty nice. And what, let, let's just make the brush all the way. Just huge. Boom. Look at that. One big spot. And that's easy. I love it. That's the easiest painting there is. If only every game had painting like that. I'd be all, I'd be here for it. Just whoosh, and it's done. Just slop it on. Just woof. It's nice and dark in here. You'll have all the ennui while you're in this room. Uh, we'll actually make this a different color. So let's go here. Uh, paint brush options. Let's let's make this a light color. There we go. And uh, can I paint this? Is this paintable? That's not paintable. That is. So that is. Huh. So apparently you cannot paint that room. So you can't paint your toilet. Uh, can you do anything with this? No. Nope. Not a thing. So that's not going to happen. No worries. It is what it is. Let's now go back. Man, again, all these people. I, I hope that you're very, very patient people. You all seem to be. I'm just, I'm glad for that. They're all like, what are you doing, sir? Why are you not helping me? Uh, it's because there's 12 of you and I have one room available. And we're working on getting a second one. So we're going to go here, rooms, hourly, and let's see, online shop, furniture, and hourly, we need, okay, so same thing. We're going to go and we're going to get a uh, toilet and a single seat sofa. And we needed what else? Let me see if I can remember this. We need a lamp. Uh, let's get let's get that one. That one's kind of modern looking. We need a nightstand. Uh, I like that one. We need a single bed. So let's get that. We need a sink. Fancy. And we need a toilet. Not so fancy. Oh, I already grabbed one of those. So the, oh, those are all my things. That's all. The purchase. All right. It's on its way. So, again, uh, I'll, I'll get to all of you in a minute. Meanwhile, while we're waiting for our delivery truck to show up, we'll, we'll start cleaning up room three. See if we can get, get this done. I should have ordered more than one of everything. Next time I do this, I'm going to order three. I'm just going to order everything from rooms three through five and do this. Uh, that looks like some uh, Chinese food, possibly. It's really just say Asian food, because who knows what kind of food it was. Um, I should probably just say food. So just stick with that. And all the milk. There are previous packages in the unloading zone. Please stock these previous packages in the warehouse before the delivery truck. Oh, man. So you mean to tell me that the soap there is throwing off the delivery truck? Okay. If you insist, we'll go here and we'll get rid of that. I can't believe he can't unload the truck because there's one thing of soap here. Fine. 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 Oh, no. Uh, put down the package. Uh, put it down in the basket. There. Now, can you handle it? There. Uh, you're here. Uh, please tell me you can now unload it. It's apparently Halloween. I didn't realize that. So now the truck is stuck. All right. We're gonna. Uh, there, there are no packages left in the loading zone, sir. Uh, we we have we've unloaded the loading zone. So we may be stuck. And if so, then I guess we're just going to stick with wrong, one room. And, uh, yeah, there's nothing left in the loading cell. Please stop. Oh, mate. oh it's got to be in the warehouse. Oh, man. Yeah, man, This guy's, like, really, really feisty about it. It's like, not only do you have to take it out of the loading zone, you got to put it in the warehouse, sir. I'm not going to do anything until you take your product and put it in your own warehouse. I don't care. Put it in your warehouse. But, okay, sure, I will. Why must you be that way? All right, we'll take it all. We'll put it in the warehouse so that way you can deliver stuff. I mean, why, as long as the loading zone's clear, why do you care whether, where we put it? We can put it in the office if we wanted to. Why must you be like that? All right, it's fine. Move it all. There. Are you happy now? So that way when we have something, we can do it. We've got all these signs out here. So there's a hunting area, no cutting trees. So all the poor deer out here are going to eventually meet our gun. And there looks like there's a cute bunny. That is also eventually going to also meet our gun, and it's not going to be good. 
I feel sorry for them because I'm a bad shot. Uh, well, maybe I should. <laughs> maybe that should be good because I'm a bad shot. Okay, so we're gonna go here. This room is not rentable and it's so dark. Oh shoot, I forgot a portion of that uh, color. Oh man, maybe I'll leave it like that. It's it's an accent. Well, we'll do that. So there will be people like you. You missed a spot. I I know I did. Um, that's okay. The customers will be like, why does that look like that? And it's just because that's how we roll. It's how we do it here in uh, the rusty frozen tundra. Okay, let's take the toilet. I don't have that toilet. The fact that you have to switch to the toilet that you have is a little bit confounding. And maybe they'll change that. Perhaps. Uh, sink. So, again, we got to go to E to get to the sink that we've got. We're going to set that right out here because we can. We're And, again, the lights just pop on out of nowhere. It's a little bit jarring. Single bed. Oh, may, Maybe now is going to be the time where I can do this. Because the thing I was afraid of is that I would not be able to see my... Uh, the color I had. So M for paintbrush options. Gonna try and get back down here. We're gonna try and match this color. I don't know if it's gonna work. Maybe I'll just do that whole wall. So let's go like that. And is that close? Is there a spot there? Uh, that that's pretty close. I think we got it. So uh, yeah, you waited too long and left. Well, I'm trying to get another room ready. Just give me a minute. Um, single bed. We have that one. Let's take that. We're gonna set it there. And, oh, uh, no reviews, so it's it's fine. And then we need the nightstand, so right-click. We're going to go back to the nightstand. We're going to select the one we've got. We're going to put this one at the foot of the bed just to mix it up. We're going to grab our lamp, so right-click, go back to lamp. Can I put it on the table? I can. Cool. So it's going to sit right there on the table. Nice. Right-click out. And then we need our single-seat sofa. And we'll grab the one that we got. The music in this game is very soothing. I mean, I, I will give it that. It's very pleasant. So, okay. Here we are. We're on a weekday. We blew right past Halloween. Uh, that's all right. I'm in, a, I'm in a completely different spot in here. Oh, here I am. Okay. We got a room for you. So, hi. Uh, the phone is ringing. Please go to the phone and answer it. Oh, here it is. Hello. Uh, please switch to empty hand first. Of course. Am I an empty hand? I am. Nope, not gone. Empty hand. Hello? Hi, I'm a traveling room one. I have to say, it took me almost five hours to find your motel. It's ridiculous. You're really smart. I should say that. I'm not going to. I'm really sorry about that. I sincerely hope you enjoy your stay here. It's okay. Thank you. Oh, man. I wanted to be a jerk, but I just didn't do it. Uh, so what's the matter with room two? Oh, I didn't put the room supplies in it. Ah! Doggone it. Always the room supplies. They always get you every time. And I always take the long way out. I love our motel sign. That's kind of nice. Okay, so let's go in here. Um, supplies. Why is the soap right outside the door? Again, questions. Uh, we don't ask. Never ask questions. Rules number one through eight. Never ask questions. All right, we got two rooms ready. Okay, hi. Uh, we got a room for you. There, take it. Thank you. You're welcome. And how you doing? Uh, thank you very much. Okay, uh, give us a minute. We're going to get room to... Oh, we get the store. Motel store will bring you good income. Please buy the sellable items from the online store. The purchase price of the items goes up and down all the time. So please choose the right time to buy. As your profit from the motel store grows, you will unlock more profitable items. Good luck. I really need to get another room ready. So I'm going to get the rooms ready first. Let, let, let's, let's try and do this. So we're going to go here. We're going to go to online shop. We've got plenty of that. I'm going to get all the furniture. So I'm going to get three of everything. I hope I have enough space for all this. I think I will. Uh, yeah. Oh, so that's how much space I have, I think, like in my warehouse or something like that. So we're going to get three uh, single-seat sofas. We're going to get uh, three, let's see, three lamps. Three of those. We're gonna get three nightstands. Those ones. We're going to get three single beds. And what else am I missing? Uh, three sinks. Let's do all that. Do I have all the money for that? Fifteen forty-eight. I do. So now I've got everything I need to get all three of my other rooms ready. So we're gonna do that all in one fell swoop, and then we'll worry about the online store. Or not the online store. We'll worry about the store. Why do I always run out this way? 
I don't know. So let's pick up all of the garbage. And, oh, no garbage in here. Wow, that's interesting. Uh, but stains galore. So let's grab our mop and swipe and run and swipe and run and swipe and strafe and swipe and run. Deliveries unloaded new packages. Yeah, please stock them in the warehouse. I know, because otherwise the delivery driver won't put anything down. He's like, sir, you did not put your product in your warehouse. I, it has to be in your warehouse. It didn't even come from us, but you got product here. And if you do not put your product in your warehouse, I will not unload my truck, sir. It's very strange. Okay, that's ready. Let's uh, go ahead and paint this. Paint brush. Get all the paints. Just, I love that paint. I do. It's so simple. Just, I mean, again, there's probably a way to stripe all this and do things. You could change the brush sizes, but I just don't have the time. I cannot be bothered with such folly. We just got to get in here. We got to get them painted. Got to get them cleaned. We got to move on. Uh, this one, oh, all the pizza boxes. There was definitely a pizza party in here. So garbage bag. Our garbage bag is unlimited. That is kind of nice. You never run out of space in your garbage bag. So props to that. You just keep on holding everything you can in your garbage bag. So there you go. All right, let's get all this done. Look at me being proactive and trying to get three rooms ready at once, even if it means I've got customers impatiently waiting at the door. It's okay because I've got stuff to do. I've got to get rooms so that way. Oh, man, that was like a, a, a dab and spin. It was a dab and pivot. Uh, <laughs> we haven't pivoted in a while. We've, we've been suffering from a lack of quality pivots here. Um, the games that we play have not really been, have not lend the, lended themselves, lent themselves to it. Can't do a lot or don't need to do a lot of quality pivoting in the card shop. All right. All the color. Just, just, or it's more like right on the wall. Just like that. And uh, can we paint any of this? Oh, yeah. I got to paint that. Okay. Perfect. Four rooms painted. One to go. I might change this one back to orange. So, oh, let's go back to that. And M, I'm getting good at this. And uh, where is my orange? It's more reddish. There. That's pretty good. I can put up one of those crazy decals in there. Maybe I'll do that. I think I can put one up in here. <laughs> I might put one right above the bed. So if I was going to put the bed, okay, let's let's clean up everything first. So let's do this. So uh, garbage bag, all the pizza, all the milk. Uh, garbage bins, my garbage bag is full. Oh my gosh, it took that long? Wow, you could hold a lot of garbage. Please go to the motel garbage bins and empty the garbage bag. So um, where are the garbage bins? It's going to try and tell me to do something else, but I want to find the garbage bins, darn it. Oh, right there. Perfect. It's just flashing. And bouncing back and forth. And while we're here, we'll take all of our product and we'll put it all into the warehouse. Because we don't want anyone to be, like, giving us trouble for not uh, putting stuff in our warehouse. I don't want to... I just want to put this in my warehouse. I don't want to pick it up. I, I want to put it in my warehouse. Okay, so why am I not... Oh, do oh, I got to go to my basket, you maroon. You were doing so good for the longest time. And then you blew it! Okay, now you got it. So all that can go in there. Boom, 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 boom. I love the way it just... Three of everything. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful thing. I love the inventory system. That is a wonderful thing. Uh, where's the motel again? It's back here. So it's over... Oh, they're over here. Here are my rooms. People are like, what the heck is that guy doing? Why is he not here? Um, oh, yeah, I was painting this room. I was cleaning this room. I ran out of room in my garbage bag. There it's, there's where we were. Man, lots of beer. Definitely having a beer party in here. Okay, one piece of garbage... Okay, weekly electricity bill. Electricity costs money. You'll leave an, you will receive an electricity bill every three days. Bill includes the motel's basic electricity usage, washing machine usage. I have a washing machine, room usage, and lightning u lighting usage. Maybe lightning usage. I'm a local, but we never knew we had such a great motel in our area. That's nice. That looked like a manhole cover. Why is there a manhole cover in here? 
I mean, were, what, were they playing quarters with manhole covers in a beer bottle? Uh, that doesn't work, but I, you, you never know. Possibly. All right. Dabbing and pivoting and dabbing. And swing, and let's go like that. Run, and go like that, and swing, and just a little bit more, and slide. Oh, and I missed that one. <laughs> okay, there's that. Now, okay, so we're going to put this away, and we're going to grab our paintbrush, and we're going to go here, and we're going to get this, and we're going to hop out of here, and maybe I'll make this a little bit smaller. So let's do that. And, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> sure. <laughs> yeah. That's that's not freaky at all. People are going to be like, please don't give me room five. Please don't give me room five. I don't want room five. Okay. Um, sofa. Not that one. We don't have that one. Let's go here. And I might just go run from room to room because I've got them. Is that going to be faster? I don't know. Will it be faster? Probably not. Uh, can it go here? Uh, nope, this isn't going to be faster. So I was thinking it might be, but it's not. All right, so there. And then we'll go right-click out and just go down the line. So we've got a uh, lamp. I want to get the nightstand up first. So the nightstand, which I don't have that one. So we got to go E. Oh, shoot. Uh, 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 shoot, I didn't want to put the chair there. Okay, can I pick up the chair? So edit mode is O. So, okay, so we're going to pick you up. We're going to swing you over there. Got it. And then we're going to uh, go back to place mode. And then rotate. We got a nightstand. I don't want another one. I want a uh, single bed. That's going to go there. Okay. Oh, I don't have that one. Oh, shoot. Single bed. And E. And place. And rotate. Okay, and then we're going to go back to our lamp and put that there. Then finally, going to go forward to, oh, right click. We're going to go to sink, that one, and toilet. So no one needs a shower in this place. Don't, don't even think about it. They just need a toilet in our giant bathroom. There, and you don't even need a toilet paper holder. I mean, or toilet paper, apparently. It's, again, don't ask questions. That's why we got the bars of soap. Oh, uh, yeah, we got to empty our hand. Okay, put in supplies. One, done. Got it. Awesome. You're good. Okay, so now, what room was this? This was room four. So let's go back to room five. Let's set up the rest of this with the giant cat on the wall. And we're going to go back into here. Furniture placement. We'll set up the toilet, because I've got it here. Again, the music is so soothing. I don't have that toilet, so we've got to select that one. We're going to go right-click, going to go back to the sink, select the one that we have. I'm assuming that they have piping along this wall. It would be funny if they didn't, and I'm just setting sinks out there, and there's no actual water that is available there. People <laughs> be like, what the heck is this? What is this place with the giant cat on the wall? Um, it's okay. It's the place of your nightmares, so just get used to it. It's what you asked for. You're in the Arctic, darn it. Um, don't ask questions. So, all right, nightstand. Right about that. Close out of that. I'm getting better at this. Lamp right on top of the nightstand. Lighting up the cat. And uh, that's so good. And then finally, the uh, what else did I get? The single seat sofa. Oh, I already put that in. So I've got one, two, three, four, uh, five, six. I've got everything I need in this room. Why am I messing with it? So room three. Here we go. One more time, once with feeling. Single seat sofa. Right about, uh, we'll set it, we'll, we'll set this one near the, not that one. You don't have that one, Rusty. But we'll set this right over here. And then we will right click out. We will go to the nightstand next. Uh, we'll go to the nightstand next, and then E, and place. No, not there. Um, O. Pick that up. There. Got it. And then right-click. Back to the lamp. 
stayed on the one we have this time. That's kind of nice. Then right click to the single bed and go to the one we got. That's so weird that it does that like that. And I'm thinking that maybe that'll be something that they change when they get further into the demo. Possibly. Maybe. Because it's so weird that it like highlights the one you don't have. Instead of just giving you the things that are actually in your inventory, it gives you all the options, regardless of whether or not you have it. So there we go. All those are set up. Uh, oh, I didn't put the uh, decorative uh, soap in them. So uh, we got a... Oh, no. Uh, okay, so right-click out. And uh, I think I'm. I think my hand's empty now. Okay, so there's that. I don't know how many people have been waiting at the desk. I'm not all that worried about it. They're they're patient. They're in the Arctic, darn it. This room's actually ready. So that room's ready. That room's ready. And we're gonna get room five ready. I think all we need here, cat, is the decorative soap or the disposable soap. Maybe it's also decorative. It could be disposable and decorative. You don't know. There's all that. So all those rooms are ready. Uh, well, one and two are not. So one and two are not. So we've got to... Yeah, they've waited too long and left. I know. I'm, I'm, I'm getting the rooms ready. I want to do all five at once, darn it. Just give me my shot. We've got no more garbage. we got some stains. So swipe. There's one more stain around here. Where are you? Random stain in there. That's done. We're going to go here. We're going to put in another disposable decorative soap. That's ready. Let's go back to room one. And we're going to be able to rent five... Giant box in the middle of the floor. We're going to be able to rent five rooms at once. How about that? We won't have five customers, but we'll be able to rent five rooms. So we got that going for us. Okay. I want to say that that's dirt. I really hope that's dirt, because if it's not dirt and it's something else, I don't want to know how it got all the way over there. I just don't want to know. All right, there's that disposable soap. One move, done. All's good. We can do five rooms at once now. Look at us go. Oh, we painted that wall. <laughs> Oops. Uh, how, how, how do we do that? How do we even manage that? I don't know how we did that. It's so crazy. All right. Uh, oh, here you go. Uh, room one, take it. It's all yours. Um, it took almost my whole life to wait in line, and I gave up. Yeah, we were getting all the rooms ready. Sue me. There you go. You checked in successfully. Hi. Uh, you want a room. There. Thank you. Hi. You want a room. There you go. You get a room. And you get a room. And you get a room. And everybody's happy. Ain't life grand. Now we can actually, it's the weekend. Um, is he going to come to play? So now we can go here, and we can actually uh, purchase some sellable goods online. Okay. Oh, and we should probably clean up the floor. I remember I told us way back when that we should do that. That was like at the 20-minute mark in the video. So <laughs> let's go back to the laptop. Oh, so you can get a laptop in this game. Why don't they give that to you right away? That would really be nice. I mean, only jokers go back to the office computer. So sellable. This stuff looks all very, 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 very similar. I've seen this before. All it needs is some window chicken, and life would be complete. Is there window chicken here? How do you have a place and you don't have window chicken? You've got everything else. You've got all the other things here. I mean, you've got the honeybees. How do you not have the crispy chippy? How do you not have Arctic crispy chippy? I mean, come on now. You've got the apple juice, you've got the top cakes, you've got the kitty litter from supermarket together, you've got the chippos, but not the covidos. How do you do this? You've got, I mean, you had a perfect opportunity to have window chicken, you don't have it. People would have loved that here. Oh man, such an opportunity to miss. Boo on you, I say boo on you. All right, let's get one of everything. Sure, why not? I mean, Arctic beer, you gotta have, it's not Arctic beer, it's just beer. Everything else is Arctic, but that's beer. So chocolate milk mix, put in your beer. Homemade cakes, they're also called top cakes. And cat food and dog food. There's all that, purchase all that. Man, it's only $75 for all that? Wow, that's a bargain at any price. Hi, uh, I only have five rooms, I can't help you, I'm sorry. Um, I only have five rooms, I can't help you, I'm sorry. I'm going to have food here pretty soon. 
So I, I love it. I politely let the customer leave. <laughs> As opposed to restraining them and keeping them in the motel against their will, I guess that would be the other option. I don't know. It's very strange. We're going to go here. I'm going to remember to grab my basket this time. There we go. We got our basket. And we're going to right-click all this. So, again, the, the, the textures and everything in here could be better. So, if I, I do want to try this now. So, if I'm going to go back to settings. And we're going to go back to quality. And we're going to go back up to, to ultra again. And we're going to see what happens. So, we're going to go to ultra. We're going to try to go to ultra. Oh, boy. It's thinking about it. Uh, please give it a minute. There we go. Uh, went to high. Uh, let's try ultra. Again. So, this will take a second. It's got to think about it. So I just want to see what it's going to look like once again. So you can see, like, the full-blown textures of everything. But it's going to probably be all kinds of jagged in terms of... Uh, well, right now, the, the, the frame rate's not horrible. So, yeah, these are the, like, the... Oh, I don't have my basket out. So these are, like, the full-blown textures. Oh, yeah, it gets so stuttery. So we're going to go back to that. Yeah, everything gets so stuttery in Ultra. So, uh, yeah, back to settings. Back down to medium we go. So quality and medium. Yeah, and that gets rid of a lot of the jaggedness of it from what I've seen. Resume. And uh, don't pat the wall. Just uh, don't pat the wall. We don't need you to pat the wall. Just need you to put all this stuff up here. Uh, basket mode. So you got to be in basket mode to move everything. That's kind of funny. So basket mode. Take all the items. Put them all on the shelf. There you go. Life is good. So back we go. Go to the store and put the goods on the shelf. I think I can handle that. Maybe. Let's find out. I can't believe that I painted those walls. I have no idea how I painted those walls. No clue. So warehouse. So these items are in the warehouse. So we're going to take all these. Can I pick? Can I select them all at once? Can I shift? It? Can I click? No, you've just got to move them. Did I literally order one of everything? So let's see. Move. Did it move everything? It. So move. Let's see. One move. So you've literally got to do that each time. So did I literally buy one of each thing? Is that the way that worked? Arctic countryside cookies. That was butter. Is that? Yeah, that's butter, guys. Um, is that what they call Arctic countryside cookies up here? Butter? Um. That's so interesting. Okay, there's all that. Can I put the decorative disposable soap up there? I'm not going to do that. I literally bought one of everything. Okay, that's kind of hilarious. I thought it was going to be like a whole box of everything, and it was not. So, uh, you checked out. Did you? Yeah. Okay, you checked out. Awesome. You, uh, give me a minute. I can check you out, and you are waiting for a room. All right, let's clean up some rooms real fast. And then we can get you in the rooms. So give us a minute. I got to clean up rooms three, four, and five. So let's do this real fast. Take care of this. So we got one piece of garbage. No stains in here. Wow, they were tidy. They had tidy feet. They must have taken off their shoes. So hand, hand, and decorative disposable soap. Cool. Now we're going to go to room four. This room is a nightmare zone. We're going to pick all this stuff off the floor. There. One, uh, two more pieces of garbage. One more piece of garbage. There you are. Now, if I come in here one of these times and I find a manhole cover, I'm calling shenanigans. Um, so let's hope that that doesn't happen. Okay, there's that. We got one more stain. I'm going to have to get some more decorative soap pretty soon. So we're going to need to do that. So more decorative soap will have to be inbound. Okay, back in room five. Wow, they did nothing in here. Cats! They, <laughs> maybe they were too scared. <laughs> they decided, you know what? We are not doing anything in here. We are not leaving any kind of a mess. We're just going to get up and leave as fast as we can. Okay, so you're checking out. 
Thank you. Man, you were really jamming. The motel is leveled up. Your motel has been upgraded. This will bring many benefits. One, a room type will potentially be unlocked. Please refer to the room unlocking conditions in the motel computer for more information. Two, the next level of bus station and parking lot can now be built. More traffic, more guests will arrive at your motel. You will be able to hire more special agents. Uh, awesome. And we'll take back your room key. And we can get you checked in. You can go to room three. Hi. You can go to room four. Hi. You can go to room five. Hi. Uh, you... Sorry. <laughs> we just don't have anything for you. Oh, uh, so... Oh, and you're here. Hi. You, you've got that. So, all right. Cash register. You can use the cash register when customers are waiting to register. Scan all the items at the register and the customer will pay. Cool. Um, okay. This is bad. Uh, no. So we got to scan. We got to literally. So I could scan the wall. I could scan the customer. Um, we're just gonna put that right there. There. Just not gonna do anything else with that. Okay. Uh, you are. Are you Lara Croft? Uh, room service. Motel guests also want to buy things from your store. They may place room service orders. Please deliver the goods to their rooms to finish the room service orders. Guests will pay for your delivery. Uh, okay. Man, all the positive reviews. Look at that. So many positive reviews. And we just found a laptop. You can now manage every, everything on your laptop. Please switch to laptop mode. Okay. Uh, yeah, I want to go to laptop mode. And we now have a pet-friendly room. People love pets, and they're willing to spend money on pets. Well, do we sell pets? Pet-friendly rooms are profitable and very popular. It is not restricted by season. Each type of room has a unique setup to meet the needs of unique upcoming guests. Please go to your pet friendly room to check what is needed to set up the room or what are needed to set up the room in this case. Uh, hi. Oh, you're just a regular customer. And so you are there. This might be a good time to stop. We've got some good stuff here. We've, we've made a lot of progress. We got five rooms ready. We are now at the point where we have pet friendly rooms. I'm just trying to find my road sign. I don't know where it is. Where did my road sign go? It's over here somewhere. Uh, where'd you go? I can't find my road sign. It's out here somewhere. Uh, you know what? Maybe I won't worry about it. We'll, <laughs> we'll just go here for the outro. I've got a room sign somewhere. Uh, this one, this is pretty interesting. There's definitely more to be seen in the demo, so we will probably have another episode of this to see what exactly the pet-friendly rooms were about, what exactly the axe is about, what exactly my laptop is about, uh, see how many customers we can make angry, see how many customers we can make happy. Uh, definitely more to be seen and again thank you very much to the team at one slice of pizza games for the advanced copy of this for me to be able to show you off the demo of this will be available on september 30th for your playing pleasure as well but we'll definitely do a little bit more of this before that time that is going to be all for this one thank you guys so very much for watching if you like this video i'd appreciate it if you gave it a like if you really like this video i'd love it if you consider giving the channel a subscribe look at all that flashing stuff on the right but until we meet again, thanks as always for being a part of all of my silliness. I'm Rusty Champagne, and we will see you later.